Jeremy Clarkson admitted he has all the answers to the cladding problem and urged Secretary of State Michael Gove to take head of his suggestions. Jeremy Clarkson, 61, admitted he still hasn't got round to dealing with the repercussions of the 2021 London flash floods, after his West London block was deluged. After discussing the ongoing cladding issues on some of the capital's high-rise flats, he went on to highlight this big issue. A conversation perhaps triggered by the severe weather that recently hit the UK this past week. On 12 July 2021, nearly 76 mm of rain fell in 90 minutes in parts of London, which resulted in flash floods. Jeremy was among those affected by the water devastation, writing, like many others in West London our block was deluged with a NOAA-sized tidal wave that swept into the ground floor flats and the lift shaft, putting it out of action for weeks. And now the insurance companies are saying that even though we pay them £80,000 a year, we are not covered for flood damage anymore. I haven't worked out quite what to do about this yet. But I will. And it's likely to involve something I saw in the torture museum in Carcassonne recently. He added, I am not quite sure how it works or where all the straps go, but ITD be fun to sit an insurance man on it and find out. Jeremy ended his column with a plea to readers. Penning, I urge you to email my idea to Michael Gove. Gove is Secretary of State for Housing, Communities and Local Government, and the Grand Tour presenter was adamant he knew how to fix the cladding problem on some of the high-rises. I have a flat at the top of a 16.8 meters block in London, which in 2010 was redeveloped and made to look more attractive with cladding, he explained, adding that this specific type of cladding is perfectly safe. A claim confirmed by experts. There is a dry riser that enables the fire brigade's hoses to reach every floor simultaneously and a lift that can still be used even if the rest of the building is an inferno, he detailed. Frankly, I stand more chance of burning to death while scuba diving.